what's up everyone it's your girl special treasure and welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be doing oh my god there's something like on my hand so in today's video i will be doing something a little different i will be doing another review video i haven't done a review in like two years at this point but i thought it would be good to do this review because i'm changing something with my hair and i want to try it out for the first time before we get into today's video make sure you guys follow me on all my social medias comment down below something sweet like this video subscribe do everything you're supposed to do to support me and yeah let's get into today's video see here i have some of my hair products right here let me show you guys what i am doing so i'm trying new hair products today i'll show you guys what i typically use and then i'll show you guys what i'm using instead so the biggest thing that i am changing is my edge control use so i usually use this one it is the cream of nature argan oil so i usually use this edge control it's super cheap honestly that's most likely why i use it um, and I've just been using it for so long. No, it does not have the best hold, but I'm not one of those girlies that's like, I need my edges to be laid, obviously, like, I'm looking crazy right now, but, um, my niece been getting on me about changing my edge control, because she's like, you have the worst edge control ever, and I'm like, freak you, okay, so she convinced me to buy this, and apparently they have multiple scents, but I got the, um, Kiss Colors and Care Edge Fixtures 24 Hours Max Hold Strawberry Akai Scent. I don't know if you guys can see it. Is this what the girlies do? Is this what the girlies do? I'm going to use that. I also decided to get um this Aunt Jackie's Flaxseed Reese. Oh my god. Aunt Jackie's Gel. It's a Don't Shrink Flaxseed Elongating Curling Gel. I've been, um I'm on maybe day five of my hair after I washed it. And I, oh my god, no, not even day five. Oh my god, I'm on like day seven. Um, and I've just been wearing it up. I either wear it out or, I, you know, use a Nike tie and pull it, you know, in a slicker puff or whatever just to keep it on my face. This Sunday, I will be washing my hair. So it's Friday right now. So I thought it would be a good idea to kind of, you know, make sure I dress it up a little bit for the weekend. I can work with it a little bit. And then on Sunday when I wash everything out, you know, I've already tried these products already. I don't want to try these on freshly clean hair in case I don't like it. So that's the whole purpose behind that. In addition to those two products, um, I will be using my regular moisturizer, which is the um, Olive Miracle Anti-Breakage Formula, the Daily Moisturizer or daily hydration oil moisturizer lotion i use this for my hair lotion and then i have a um argan oil cream of nature um leave-in conditioner that works really well on my hair as well so i'll be doing that and i thought it'd be cool to take you guys along with me while i while i try these out okay my biggest reviews um or my biggest purpose of this video is to see how well this curls up my hair and if it looks really nice once dry and then how well this looks on my edges and if they look sleek and clean. So first things first, let's take my hair out of this tie. I look like I'm the man. Yeah, but I was done up like last week. Tell me where have you been? You guys can still see like the color in my hair even though i've dyed it black ouch that really felt good the color in my hair even though i've dyed it black you guys can see i mean in the beginning of course it was jet black and then after i got my braids and i washed my hair a lot of the color left with it i was kind of kind of mad so now that my hair is nice here i say it like that now my hair is um nice and moisturized i am going to use the gel now and you guys will see me do a couple finger curls 
to just make some of the curls pop um especially like in the front a lot of it is brushed out because i'm always brushing my hair so um but a lot of the curls in the back because you guys can see the coils be coiling the front is always wavy the back is always more like a tighter curl so i never know what to label my videos when i talk about my hair because i don't know if it's four c three i don't know it's confusing because like the front half is one thing and then the back half is another God, look at the length that be lengthened though. The length that be lengthened though. The length that be lengthened though. Okay. All right. Let me actually. I'm sorry. Sometimes I just be obsessed with my hair because it's actually like it took a lot for me to like love my hair. And the fact that I wanted to shave my head bald is like insane. <laughs> so I'm going in with the Aunt Jackie's gel and let's see how this works. I'm just going to do a. And so when I whenever I apply gel to my hair, I always start from the back and work my way up. And I'm not a cosmetologist, and I don't need anyone in the comments telling me how I should and should not be doing my hair. Unless you have true like constructive criticism, then cool. But I don't need anyone really like doing too much because my last two review videos, you guys went off. Like I got fifteen thousand views on that one video, and I had to delete so many of the comments because it was so mean. I left, a, I left some on there because I responded and I had to tell them, like, shut up. I really need to do some oil treatments to start repairing my edges. I used to do, put my hair in a mohawk all the time when I was younger. Look at that redness that's in my hair, bro. That's what's up. That's mad fire. Cool brush, brush up. Ooh. I'm not going to use my Nike time. I'm actually going to use this one, which is a smaller one. Bow. So push that back a little bit and I'm going to take my edge control brush let me get close for this because I'm blind and just do what needs to be done with the edges cute I just cleaned my edge control brush too so it feels super nice and then Remember when we used to just do this and put gel on it and just leave it down? Like, why are we doing that? All right, so I put a little bit on my brush. So you guys can see, my niece used some when she was here last weekend, but I told her I'm going to wait to review it. Everybody edges have to be dead because I have a funny, I don't have a funny shaped head, but my forehead is small. So I feel like huge edges on me look ridiculous because like if I left it down there, that would look crazy to me. My forehead is so damn big, you feel me? fits my head not too much and then I always like to pull something from here and I'm going to gel up this part take a little bit of gel onto here mix with the edge control on my finger and just do a quick little quick little coil nothing crazy all right, so here's here's how it looks. I think it actually came out really good. I like a more natural look. Like they're not too perfectly shaped, which I hate, but I want it to be somewhat symmetrical, but it looks super natural because I'm all about natural the natural look. Like I I've never wore Lace front wigs. I'm not a fan of like curtains as edges. I'm just not a fan. It's just not for me. 
So, here's what it looks like. That's wait, hold on. Alexa, what time is it? It's 4:55 p.m. So 4:55 p.m. This is what they're looking like. I'm going to go wrap my edges for about an hour. Go do a few things and then come back to you guys to see what they're looking like. But I think they're going to hold. It looks pretty good. And I love the shine. I'll be back when it's time. Maybe, I don't know, in a couple hours. See how it is. But I'm going to be running around doing things around the house. So usually my edges will sweat out using these. Um, well, this, I should not these, using this product, which I know it usually does. I'm just too cheap to actually invest in one. This was like $8. So <laughs> I had to actually spend money. Which I'm not a fan of. But yeah, I'll be back in a couple hours and we'll see how this is. Okay. <laughs> Literally almost forgot to film the rest of this. So, you guys, it is hopefully, I don't know if I have this on the same setting. I hope I do. It is much darker out, so I have no, like, outside day, um, outside light or anything. So I hope that it's the same as earlier. But look at my, <laughs> it looks so good. So it's 7 o'clock. It's seven o'clock on the dot. I'm in the drop top. Ah. You guys ever just remix that song based on whatever time it is? It could be like, like literally be like, it's the o'clock on the dot. It's ten o'clock on the dot. I'm in the. It doesn't matter what time it is. Like you're gonna sing that song. But um, okay. So here's, like literally, it's down. I can literally hear my head like it's like swoop. It looks really good. And like I said, I like a natural swoop. I don't like nothing too. Look at my hair color. I like it. I like it. <sighs> Bear with me. Um, Look at it though. I mean, even my hair. Look how moisturized and cute it looks. Look how like the volume is there. Oh my God. Nothing's better than a, a good old moisturized curly puff. Excuse me. Oh my god. I like this a lot. I don't know why this is so out there. I was laying down, so that could be why. But I love my little my little curls on the side. That's like my that's like my thing. I didn't really talk about it, but I can smell it when I was laying down because I was like all covered up and stuff like that. This smells really, really good. This strawberry acai, acai, right? Yeah, strawberry acai smell is really, like, strong. I did that. I did that, if you ask me. If you ask me. I just want to go ahead and rate this. I would say I'll rate this a 9 out of 10. Um, it smells really good. The hold is there, and it wasn't hard to apply. It's not heavy, it's not super thick, and it's not flaking. So, like... It's doing everything it's supposed to do. And right here is dry. Like, it doesn't feel wet. You know how sometimes, like, can, like even, like, hours later, edge controls can feel, like, super, like, gucky? It doesn't feel that way. So, that's a plus. And then when it comes to this, I have nothing bad to say about it at all. I mean, but the main focus was the edge control. But, um, yeah. That is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed um, if you guys want me to review or try other products, please let me know and I can do so. But in the meantime, make sure you guys follow me on all my social medias. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!